Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to our channel and thanks for logging on. If you enjoy these videos, do me a favor and subscribe to our YouTube channel right here at Watchbox Reviews. I would really appreciate it and I promise to update daily. If you like this watch, you can see it and the entire 2018 Breitling Premier Collection at our Philadelphia flagship store, Gothburg on Walnut Street, Center City, Philadelphia. And today we are discussing the 2018 Breitling Premier Chronograph 42, arguably the bread and butter model of the new line. The timepiece is true to its name, 42 millimeters in diameter on my 16 centimeters circumference wrist. You can see it cuts an imposing stance, but it's not quite oversized in the sense of most recent Breitling watches up to 2018. This is a watch that is full-sized, not ungainly. The timepiece is relatively slim at 13.9 millimeters thick, but you'll note the double-stepped, double gadron bezel and the curvature of the box section sapphire make it easy to slide a jacket cuff over this watch. Lug to lug 49.9 millimeters. If you include the solid end links of the bracelet, 53.7, and the spacing between the lugs, 22 millimeters, for those of you who wish to accessorize. The watch is available on both bracelets and straps, so you will have your choice. Important to note that as seen on the bracelet, the watch costs $6,550 at the time of filming. So right in the meat of the market, this is priced below the Premier B01 Chronograph 42 and above some of the more basic models, namely the Automatic 40. You will note the timepiece with a Navitimer style seven link bracelet. If you remember the Navitimer bracelet, it's just a little bit finer and more supple on the wrist than the five link pilot because of the small links. The integration of the end link with the case is superb, mostly of high polish. There's some satin finish on the flanks. You can see the individual sizing done by removing double screws and on the underside plenty of channels to avoid pinching skin gripping hair or trapping heat on the wrist the single fold deployant clasp is locked with a clamshell and very secure as you can see mostly of high polish the breitling b now shorn of its wings georges kern and his team want you to think of breitling as a land sea and air company premier is the land collection navitimer is the air collection and the super ocean well do i really need to explain you will note the interior of the clasp an undersold feature has four discrete anchoring points. I'm going to try to show you this, but there are four anchoring points inside the clasp, so you can actually move the anchoring point of the bracelet forward and backwards through those four positions using a strap tool for precise sizing. Jumping back to the case and lug junction, my, but that is a nicely integrated end link. You can see the lugs are less brutal than they were in the past. Though the watch is broad across the wrist, one of the reasons it wears well on smaller wrists is because these lug profiles have been pared down and better tapered. You can see how there's a camber to the case so it wraps itself around the wrist. The new Breitling is all about reducing the brutality and span, perhaps we should call it the wingspan of its lugs, and this is proof in practice that they mean business. A combination of satin and polish, there's a flaring bevel down the flank of the lug molded in. And then on the side, you can see linear striations that evoke the mid-century period to which the entire Premier line pays reference and deference. There was a Breitling Premier collection through the 40s and 50s, and these watches are loosely inspired by that late Art Deco, early mid-century modern, evoked by the combination of strong linear striations as well as curves. Double Gaudron stepped and polished bezel. You have that sapphire profile that is boxed and cambered. Kind of an expensive way to make a sapphire, so pennies not pinched here, but it also evokes a mid-century plexiglass or thermoplastic crystal, so it's also an historical nod. The dial is richer than I expected. All applique indices, you will note a stepped and raised tachymeter scale outboard, a sporty touch for a chronograph, calibrated to 700 units. This is used for gauging the speed of very fast things between known points, such as the start and stop of a standing kilometer. Sub-registers countersunk. There is a nicely hidden monotone date disc at 6 o'clock. Breitling single B, again, no more wings, at 3 o'clock, balanced by the constant seconds register over at 9. The dial is minimally loomed. You will get a good sense of that later when I show you the loom shot. What I want you to take away is that the applique indices, the metallic black sunburst at center, and the different focal planes starting at the hands, jumping down to the tachymeter, and then to the base of the registers gives the dial great depth and the impression of expense and quality. Chronograph pushers, a combination of satin finish and polished. You can see they're rectangular in the form of the mid-century, as was the practice during the 40s and 50s in many instances. You will also note a richly knurled and almost 
somewhat spiky and severe profile to this Breitling Premier line specific crown. This is a crown that is unique to this line, so even the small elements, self-consciously designed to be attractive and distinctive. The case back is somewhat basic, but you will note it's both a Breitling and a chronometer. For good measure, it's also 100 meters water resistant, and inside the case, the tried and true Breitling Chronometer Caliber 13, based on a Valshu 7750, 25 joules automatic winding, 48 hour power reserve, it features both stop seconds and a quick set function for the date. Ultimately, it is a tank tough movement that has been precisely adjusted to get a chronometer certificate, so the best of both worlds, durability and precision. It's also a handsome watch that wears well on wrists as small as 14 and a half centimeters circumference. So in addition to durability and precision, it also has versatility. A sports and dress style, you could wear this watch with just about anything, anywhere. See it and make it yours at our flagship Goffberg store in Center City, Philadelphia. And we're back with the 2018 Breitling Premier Chronograph 42. Minimally loomed, you can see the hour and minute hand otherwise quite spare. See it by day at our store, Center City, Philadelphia.